In less than seven minutes, I'm going to show you how to rank your website on the first page of Bing and massively increase the organic traffic, free traffic. Using my seven step checklist, you'll be ranked right here in position number one. It is much easier to rank on the first page of Bing than Google as there is less competition. At the end of this video, I'm also gonna show you an easy hack to get 100 backlinks in 10 days guaranteed. Backlinks will help drive more traffic to your site. With all this free traffic, you can market, sell, and promote whatever you like. Let's do this. First on our checklist is we need to update our page titles to be between 55 and 70 characters. If you're using WordPress, simply go into the admin panel, click on a page, click edit. I use a plugin called Yoast SEO. If you've installed that, you'll get this little box down the bottom and you can see SEO title. We just want to update this. So this is for a website that is a global community coffee marketplace. So it makes sense here. I've just updated the title to be home. Silk Road Coffee Marketplace. And you can see that here. And we get this green indicator telling us where within that correct text range. If you're using something like Wix, you simply go across into the admin area to, to update the site. Go to sites and menu, say for the home page, you just click here and we click SEO basics. And then we can go down and we can update the page title here. That's looking pretty good. If you're using Shopify, just go into the product, scroll down to the bottom and you will get this area here and you can update your page title. So again here, I've updated this to be between 55 and 70 characters. That's looking good. Next on our checklist, is page descriptions. What we need to do is update these descriptions to be between 130 and 150 characters. In WordPress, you'll find it just here. It says meta description if you're using the Yoast SEO plugin, and we just update this text here. If you're using Wix, you'll find something very similar. It's just here. It's really important to get that text concise and throw in a few keywords, if possible, related to your content. And on Shopify, you'll see the same here. So next on our checklist, is keyword research for our site here, our global community coffee marketplace. If we want to rank this on the first page of Bing, what we need to do is identify some keywords and phrases that we want to rank for. So wholesale coffee might be a good phrase to go after. So to do this, we're going to use a tool called SEMrush. If you haven't used SEMrush before, it's really easy. I'll put a link in the description for a free account. And that's really all you need for a bit of keyword research. To do the keyword research in SEMrush, you just go to keyword overview and I've just typed in wholesale coffee up here in the search bar. And you can see here, this is actually a pretty good term to go after. We've got good volume and the keyword difficulty is near 30%. I like lower than 30%, but we can still rank for this. And if we look down here a bit further on our keyword variations, most of them are below 30%. You can see KD here, that means keyword difficulty. And the majority of these keyword variations are below 30%. So let's make a note of all of those. This particular keyword has commercial intent and it has quite a high cost per click on Google and Bing. So we're saving a lot of money by sending free traffic to the site using SEO. So now we've got our keyword variations and our related keywords. We want to get this content into our site in as many places as possible that makes sense. So if we go back to our site, we can see here, I've just made a few updates. We've got, we are the leading wholesale coffee suppliers. If we go down further, updated a heading, wholesale coffee beans. You can see here, fresh wholesale coffee beans from leading suppliers, etc. So you wanna get that content in as many places as possible that makes sense. Now that we've added our keywords and phrases throughout our content, that's great, but it's not enough to get us ranked on the first page of being fast. What we need to do is draft long form content. If you go to a lot of websites, whether they sell services or products, you're going to see long form content. And the reason for this long form content is it can be written in a way that it sends all the right signals to Bing to get ranked fast. Now, if you're not an expert at writing long form content, I suggest you try a tool like Jasper. Just by giving Jasper some indication of what you want that content to be about, like coffee roasting, for example, or wholesale coffee, it will draft a very long piece of content. 
and you can use this to then optimize to drive traffic to your site. Now we've got our long form content and we've updated our site with our keywords and phrases. We need to dial in our SEO. So for our long form content, I suggest you use a tool like Surfer and it is going to tell you if you need to have more headings, more words, more paragraphs, more images, and it's gonna give you this thing called a content score. And if you get this content score over 68, you are probably going to rank very high on Bing and possibly also on Google. Run your content through Surfer and get that content score above 68. Okay, the last step is we want to hook up our website to the Bing webmaster. And the reason we wanna do this is we wanna force Bing to recrawl and re-index our site. Now we've made all of these updates and this will get our page re-ranked fast. If you don't do this, it can take months. Don't skip this step. If you follow all of the seven steps, you should be ranking on Bing. However, if you really want to take things to the next level, you might want to consider getting yourself some backlinks. There are many different ways to get backlinks, but I found the easiest way is to use a service called Brand Feature. Now, there are other options in the marketplace out there. What I used was the Pro Package, and what Brand Feature do is they actually write an article for you around your business. You just give them some basic information. They turn this around in around 10 days. So, if you want to get yourself 100 backlinks in 10 days, guaranteed, give them a go. Thanks for watching. If you've got any questions, let me know in the comments. Check out this playlist if you want more information on SEO.